17, 2026 at 11 a.m. Attention, attention, do not turn off your devices. This broadcast alert is provided by the Michigan Department of Safety and Security. Please pay attention in order to avoid as many fatalities as possible. It has come to our attention that a number of bodies have been found on the outskirts of several Michigan towns. The public is asked to remain indoors, as the source of the danger has yet to be discovered. So far, several witnesses indicated that a man wearing a mask was near the body. We are talking here about a solid white mask covering the entire face and not a typical surgical mask used during COVID. After the corresponding identification by the witnesses, it was concluded that although the masks are the same, the wearer is constantly changing. Also, all the victims were found in a state of accelerated decomposition and mummification. No animals have yet been seen at the crime scenes, but it has not yet been ruled out that this is the work of some unknown species. Due to the number of reports of men with masks, it is recommended to be locked in your home and call 911 if you see one of these subjects. It is currently theorized that they may be members of a cult, although the way they attack and cause mummification in their victims is still unknown. Although these people tend to attack individually, avoid any confrontation with them and hide in your homes when you see them, as so far there is no record of anyone apprehending one of these criminals. Stay tuned for further transmissions, we will be monitoring this case closely and we assure you that if you remain calm and act as we ask, you and your family will be safe. Thank you very much. June 25th, 2026 at 10 a.m. Attention, attention, do not turn off your devices. This alert broadcast is provided by the Michigan Department of Safety and Security. Pay attention to avoid as many fatalities as possible. This is an update on the case of fatalities in several Michigan towns, already of public knowledge. After receiving information from several cases that we were watching closely, it was concluded that these deaths are not caused by an animal or a cult. All the deaths were caused by a single mask, which clings to the face of the victim and releases a liquid that soon causes the death of the carrier. The mask has a normal size and is made of porcelain. It has the typical shape of a comedy mask, although it has also been seen in the form of a tragedy face. It is theorized that this object has some system of internal signals that expand and affect those nearby, as it was found that the victims put it on under their own free will. Before they put on the mask, the families reported erratic and uncharacteristic behavior of the victims. In case you see a person wearing a mask, it is recommended that you take as much distance as possible and do not try to help the carrier. Even if someone else is wearing it, those in close proximity are also in danger of being affected by the waves it continues to produce. It is currently theorized that by having the mask on, the victim loses their cognitive faculties and they are controlled by a third party. This is based on the fact that by having the mask on, the victims presented a great personality change and even acquired knowledge that they did not originally possess. The U.S. government has warned that they have no link with this mask. It is not excluded that this is a terrorist attack or the experiment of some other nation. Consequently, communications are being established with other countries to verify this. At this time, no ransom demands have been made. If you have information that could help us in our investigation, contact your nearest police station. We take seriously any lead that can help put an end to this situation. Stay tuned for further transmissions. We will be monitoring this case closely and we assure you that if you remain calm and act as we ask, you and your family will be safe. Thank you very much. July 5th, 2026 at 9.30 a.m. Attention, attention, do not turn off your devices. This alert broadcast is provided by the Michigan Department of Safety and Security. Pay attention in order to avoid as many fatalities as possible. This is an update on the case of deaths in several Michigan towns, already of public knowledge. After making diplomatic contact with other countries, it was found that all of them were unaware of the existence of this artifact. 
In addition, the nation's intelligence service also verified that no terrorist organization was responsible for the crimes. Recently, we received information from a reliable source that aligns with what we have been investigating so far, so the nature of this mask was verified. We have verified that this artifact, which from now on we will call Masquerade, is an autonomous being and is not managed by a third party, as speculated. Masquerade is a parasitic being that manipulates its victims to wear it. When in contact with the carrier, this being has complete control of his, her body, managing it at its own will. Meanwhile, Masquerade releases a highly corrosive acid that comes into contact with the wearer's skin and after a short period of time causes the bearer's death. When a victim carries it, it is recommended to avoid any kind of contact with Masquerade. Although it is possible to converse with it, it was found that although it gives the impression of being charismatic and even pleasant, it possesses a highly manipulative nature. Those who are close to it have been reported to have violent, confused, and even suicidal thoughts. In addition, Masquerade is a being with a much more developed intelligence than any human and by talking alone can convince its victims to help it or even to end their own lives. The population is advised to stay at home and make sure that no member of the family group goes out unless it is absolutely necessary. In case there is a sighting of Masquerade in your area, leave immediately and go to another nearby town if possible. Hiding is not the solution, as the mask can locate victims telepathically. In case you notice erratic or suspicious behavior of any person, immediately contact our special hotline, whose number is given below. No matter how close you are to this subject, avoid getting into reason with him or her or contacting a private health professional. The Michigan Department of Safety and Security disclaims any liability if you intentionally come into contact with the mask. You are responsible for your actions and although we are actively trying to put an end to this danger, we can only intervene if you follow the advice given to the letter. We have been made aware that some videos are circulating on YouTube and TikTok where citizens are trying to take advantage of this situation by filming victims with abnormal behavior. This will not be tolerated and anyone who posts or shares such videos will be prosecuted by the state of Michigan. This has not been proven but we believe that Masquerade can contact and manipulate those who view this type of video. We are actively working with social media platforms to stop the spread of these images. Stay tuned for further transmissions, we will be monitoring this case closely and assure you that if you remain calm and act as we ask, you and your family will be safe. Thank you very much.